I'm not out there fixing UFC.com. Nobody's information was compromised. That's not what happened. What they did was they got in there and moved our URL. So that when you went there, it opened to another site. And it's part of this whole thing that's going on. It's part of this, you know, and the guys that are getting on there and saying that to you, they're full of shit, dude. Okay? What this is, this is this movement that goes on the Internet, you know, and, and, and it's this thing out there, and, and I've accused everybody of it, and I'll accuse you of it too. You're scared of the Internet. And all the other reporters are afraid of the Internet. I'm not afraid of the Internet. The Internet doesn't scare me. Okay? Why does it scare us? It scares you because that's where, that's where you live and breathe and where, you know, who's going to watch your stuff and who's going to get behind you and all that stuff. I, I, I don't. I, don't, I well, think you're very Internet friendly. You're I'm, very Internet savvy. I'm, I'm very cool with the Internet. If you're, if you, the Internet is where the cowards live. Mm. Okay? It's a place where cowards live. And people who are cool and want to talk, you know, UFC or MMA, whether it be on the Internet or on Twitter or any other place. But if you want to come on and you want to be a terrorist or you want to come on and you want to act like, you know, a jerk on Twitter, mine isn't the one to do it on. You should probably go follow somebody else because I'm not afraid of the Internet. I'm not afraid of these guys who hide behind their computers. And let me tell you what, there's always this thing, it's, there's this thing that's out there about you can't stop the Internet. No, let me tell you who you can't stop and who you can't mess with, the government. Okay, and what's happened is these guys in their in their, uh, you know, whatever they think this is, and they think that they're going to overthrow and, and, you know, now that they've gone on and started hacking all these sites, it wasn't just us. There were tons of sites that were hacked, and, and I, I've heard government sites were hacked too. Mm -hmm. Now you just piss people off. But you said, and and it's it's true, I guess, that no one can beat the government there. And you know, I, I I'm sure already these investigations that the government even investigating you guys because of the purchase of Strike Force and all of this monopoly talk. What what do you make of that? And how do you foresee all of that being resolved? Have you ever seen the government came out with a come out with a release that says they're investigating the UFC? There's been a talk that uh, been, Federal Trade there's, there's, Commission. There's, there's been talk that we don't pay fighters either. The fighters get paid. And there's been talk about this and that. But has the has the government ever come out and said, we are investigating the UFC? Have, has, have you ever seen that release from, from, the, from the FTC? Just from sources. Any. No one from the government. Or can you tell us then? Have you, have you ever seen a, 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 you know, I'm sure if there was, there was this open investigation, it would have come out and it would have been like, we're investigating the UFC. You know, this thing's going to take six to eight months. Let's see what happens. And blah, blah, blah. have you ever seen a press release come out? No, yeah. Have you guys ever been? Oh, yeah. Exactly. So my point is, you know, like I said, you don't mess with the government. You start messing with the government, and what these Internet guys have done now is, is in, in, a, in a situation where, um, you know, it's almost like New York. You know, in, in New York when the towers got hit, mm -hmm. people didn't run away in fear. Did people run in fear? No, well, people mourned. And then this country got together, you know, and went out and kicked some ass. That's what happened. And now you guys on the Internet doing this goofy stuff, playing your little nerd games, you've pissed some people off. Including you. Including me. And you don't scare me. So what are you, what can you, what are you guys going to Sit do then? Sit back and see what happens over the next several months. You know? And just like any other war or any other fight, that's what this is going to be. You know? But let me tell you what. You want to get out there? And they always talk about me and, 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 and bullying people and whatever. I'm not a bully, man. If you want to fight with me, let's fight. We're going to fight then. We're not going to see a change, even now with Fox, and we've talked about this before, too. I mean, you go on the Internet, you tell people off when they have something bad to say with you. For Dana White, this is what we're always going to get. No one, no ch you know, Fox won't change you, no one will change you. No, uh, what's the change? Well, I understand, I mean, but these, I mean, these, there are some people These who guys feel are hacking my website. What do you want me to do? Go, stop hacking my website. No, I'm going to kick your ass. Go ahead. You want to keep playing these games? Play them. You're going to lose. You're going to lose. You can't stop the Internet. You cowards all hide on the Internet. You don't scare us. We're going to find you. Believe me, this is bigger than me. This is bigger than me. This is bigger than the UFC. You go out there and start acting like a terrorist, you're going to get Osama bin Laden. Osama bin Laden.